What's up, everybody? It's Coach Levins here with the question of the week. Um, last week's question of the week was, what was the name of the yoga pose that I was demonstrating? Uh, now, to hear what the answer is, I'm going to go live to uh, Gabriel Castillo from Miss Ospina's class, who's going to tell us what the correct answer is. Go ahead, Gabriel. The answer to the question of the week is down dog. Thank you, Gabriel. That is correct. The correct answer was down dog, or we would have accepted downward dog, or the uh, the actual name of the pose, which is uh, down there below, I, which unfortunately I can't say. I'm very impressed that we had a lot of people give me that as the right answer, which is the actual correct answer. And uh, a lot of people knew what that was, so good job by uh, the people we have uh, that's going to be uh, listed below who uh, got that particular question correct. Uh, well done. Um, well, the names are below. Just a reminder that the um, uh, Tabata assignment is up. Remember, Tabata only takes four minutes. Remember, it's 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Not 20 minutes. It's not 20 minutes. It's 20 seconds of hard exercise, 10 seconds of break. 20 seconds hard exercise, 10 seconds break. It's, uh, it's a great workout. It doesn't take very long and it doesn't take up that much space. So it's great. And uh, it's Tabata. And you can get until the end of next week to do it. So hopefully um, everybody will do it. If you take any great Tabata pictures, send them coach's way at, uh, at my email, which is uh, listed below, or on my class dojo, class teams, class tag account, and uh, Microsoft Teams, you want to send them there. And I'll put them at the end of next week's uh, question of the week, which is some exciting stuff. Speaking of exciting stuff, we have virtual spirit week coming up next week. And we have, uh, right now, you have a sneak preview of, uh, of Coach's um, Red, White, and Blue Day outfit, um, which is going to be on the 27th, Tuesday the 27th, Red, White, and Blue Day. And in this picture, you'll have two, two of your, two, your, your favorite things, America and Coach Levins. Boom. Then we got on Wednesday. We have a fun day, which is crazy hair day. I don't have much hair, but uh, I'm, I'm going to come up with something. Then on the... Um, on Thursday, we have Sport Team Day, which is going to be a lot of fun to finish things up. We have uh, the Furry Friend Day, where you can take a picture with your dog, cat, teddy bear, whatever it is. So good stuff. Um, now, remember, there's going to be no school or no distance learning on Monday in honor of Memorial Day. Today's question of the week is about Memorial Day. Now, um, to find out the answer to today's question, you can actually Yonkers Public Schools on their, their website. Under distance learning, under social studies, there's a whole big thing about Memorial Day, how it developed, and a lot of great stuff that's on there. Um, today's question, and you'll be able to find the answer there if you don't know it already. What was the first year Memorial Day was celebrated? Again, the question. What was the first year Memorial Day was celebrated? Please send me your answer to coach's email, which is listed below, or you can send me a message on my class dojo or class tag accounts, which uh, is a lot of fun. Hope everybody has a great uh, Memorial Day weekend. Remember to stay safe. Miss you guys, and uh, hope to see you soon. Take care. Bye.